Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I am presenting one more Sindhi recipe for you, Sindhi style sail chicken. This is well marinated chicken with yogurt and spices, it's slow cooked and we add a lot of mint and coriander leaves and some more spices to it. The slow cooked chicken always tastes better. And this is usually paired with rotis. Sindhi is also relish it with dodo, juarjo dodo, which is bakri, juar bakri in Sindhi. So let's proceed to make this flavorful Sindhi sale chicken. Sale chicken, Sindhi style chicken, marinated with yogurt and spices and slow cooked to perfection. We have taken about 500 grams of chicken with bones, 2 cups of finely chopped onion, 1 cup of tomatoes diced, coriander leaves half cup, mint leaves 1 cup, 2 teaspoons of crushed garlic, 1 teaspoon of grated ginger, 2 green chilies chopped and we have yogurt, we will be using about 3 spoons, 5 to 6 tablespoons of oil. Then we have salt to taste, 1 teaspoon garam masala powder. 1 teaspoon coriander powder, 1 teaspoon cumin powder, half teaspoon turmeric powder and half teaspoon red chilli powder. Let's begin with the marination. We are going to use half the spice powders for marination. Remaining half will be saved for cooking. Add salt, add half of the garlic. Then add 3 teaspoons of yogurt. Mix all this thoroughly. See that all the chicken pieces are coated with this marinade. Now cover it and set it aside in the refrigerator for at least one hour or even more now let's begin the cooking process take a heavy bottomed pan add the oil about five to six tablespoons saute the ginger garlic first This will take about half a minute when it changes color. Add the green chilies and the onions. Now we are going to saute the onions for one minute. Stirring intermittently. Now add the tomatoes. Now here is a tip I learned from my grandma. Add salt on top of the onions. This will give the extra sourness and help them cook faster also. Without stirring just cover it for half a minute. Now you can open the lid and stir everything. These small small tips we learn from our elders are really very useful and handy. Now add the chicken pieces, marinated chicken pieces. Stir them. This chicken doesn't require any water. It cooks in its own juices. Add mint and coriander leaves. Add mint generously, about one cup or so. And half of the coriander we'll add now and half towards the end. Give it a good stir. Now add the spice powders. Add everything except the garam masala, which we will save for the end. Mix everything together. 
and it's done just you don't have to do anything more now we have to only simmer it and cook cover it and let it simmer for 10 minutes first after 10 minutes you open the lid until then do not open the lid now at this stage we are going to turn the sides of the chicken pieces after turning the sides we'll again cover the lid and just let it simmer for 10 more minutes without opening the lid you don't have to worry because we are doing it on very low flame check the salt before closing the lid because then we can add if it is required now just allow it to simmer for 10 more minutes on low flame after 10 minutes you open and check if the chicken pieces are done you can do this with a fork almost done but it needs little more cooking maybe couple of minutes more so what we'll do is now add the garam masala powder on top and some more coriander leaves and again leave it on low flame to cook for two to three minutes or until done so now it looks like it is done it's ready to be served now you can enjoy it with your rotis or dodo which is bhakri i hope you like this chicken preparation make and enjoy it with your friends and family do share the feedback and see you soon with another interesting recipe if you are a new visitor to the channel do subscribe and also click on the bell icon to get notifications about all the new uploads check out these videos from the archives you may have missed them earlier thanks for watching have a nice day